Good morning, my name is Steve Gale, and we've been offering some self-defense classes here in Wendell for the Senior Center, and we've been having a good time. The ladies have all had a good time doing it. And when we're talking about self-defense and things that's not Bruce Lee jumping, hoochie goochie spinning, hook, hook kicks and such, it's learning how self-defense can basically be a part of your life. Okay? Everyday life, uh, you practice self-defense, whether it's driving skills, it's people's skills, um, but when we come down to physical self-defense, we also talk about that too. Then we, in our last class, we worked on weapons of opportunity. And I say that, you know, in that particular seminar, we saved weapons to the very last class. Right. Okay? We talked about, obviously, the use of weapons, et cetera, but do you need one? All those kinds of things. And in most cases, for most people, that answer is no. But we did have some fun with some sticks. Oh, yeah. Did you have some fun with the, with the stick class that we worked on? Yep. Uh, the whole class was a lot of fun. One of the main things I took from your class was that, like you were saying, it's not all physical. So even though I'm finding more and more limitations on what I can do physically, the class helped me understand that there are things that I can do that don't require physical strength. Think ways that I can use everyday things as weapons if I need to, Absolutely and perfect. ways to avoid getting in those circumstances. Because awareness, to start with. we all know, is the basis of self-defense. Yes and one of the best weapons. That's right. Looking to have some fun, learn something new, get your bodies out there moving, please stop by and see us.